Tyus, I think somebody asked earlier this year that you've just been feeling more confident with that shot that's going down. Um, at this point, do you just kind of feel like you're in a zone with your with your three-point shot at this point? Uh, Yeah, yeah, just putting, you know, a lot of work this offseason um, and just trusting in that, trusting in the work I put in um, on practice days, shoot-arounds, things like that. And then, again, um, I'm getting the confidence from, you know, coach, from the coaching staff and from my teammates. Uh, Tyus, when you do have that three-point shot going, do you just kind of see that as a way to, like, kind of just opens up the defense a little bit to where you can get downhill and create f uh, create for others? Yeah, for sure. For sure. It definitely, uh, you know, opens things up on the offensive end for me. Um, at the same time, we got a lot of guys who can create and play make. Um, and so it's just, you know, another way to uh, help out the offense, you know, because the shots are going to be there. So um, it definitely opens things up for me and then, you know, allows me to get downhill, um, whether it's to the floater um, or to find, you know, my teammates for, for open shots. And, you know, we're doing a, a good job of playing unselfish right now. Hey, Tyus, as a point guard, it's a fine line between facilitating and being aggressive. How do you know when to do that in the, in the, in the, in the floor of the game? Um, yeah, trying to find that balance. Just trying to find that balance. Um, you know, and it's a consistent, um, you know, consistent thing, a consistent thing that you're trying to uh, navigate, um, trying to find, you know, whether you're um, really trying to force an issue, um, you know, for your for your own looks or, you know, continue to play unselfish um, and just taking what the defense gives you, honestly, um, just trying to have a, a good feel for it. And there's times where, uh, you know, I feel like I'm probably playing too unselfish. Um, you know, but at the same time, there's times where, um, you know, might take a couple shots in a row where it's like I might have missed, you know, one of my guys. So it's just trying to find that that balance. And it's it's not a, not an easy thing to do. But at the same time, it's just having a having a natural feel for it. What do you make of the lineups with you and Ja on the floor together? Why did it work tonight? And do you want to do have that more often, that combination? Definitely. Uh, me and me and 12 talk about that um, all the time. And uh Glad, glad it happened tonight. Uh, you know, we love it just because it allows us to play uh, fast. Um, having two point guards on the court, um, you know, two guys who pride themselves on having a, a high uh, basketball IQ. Uh, we try to make it easier for everyone else out there on us. Um, it allows, you know, me to take some of the pressure off Ja as far as initiating the offense. Um, you know, bring the ball up sometimes, uh, giving him different looks, out, you know, on that side of the floor. So uh, we like it. Uh, we love it. And it worked for us tonight. And, you know, you know we're just going to go from there. Taylor's always talked about how it's, you know, take more threes, make more threes. And you seem like you've applied that this year. At this point, it's just being more comfortable with the let it fly offense where you're just like, at this point, if you're open, it's going up no matter what. Yeah. Again, going back to, you know, coaching the, and the staff, um, just, telling us continue to take those shots, um, continue to trust in the work that we've put in. Um, you know, and guys are, are getting comfortable and, and familiar, you know, really familiar with the system. And we're seeing where our shots are coming from. Um, you know, and we're just confident and, and comfortable in that. And so, um, you know, even on the nights we're not making a lot of shots, we're seeing we're getting getting to them and getting open looks. And it just might not be, you know, our night, but we can't shy away from um, getting to those open looks because there is nights then when we are going to make shots, um, you know, and we, and we love we love how um, you know those nights go. Obviously, Tyus, Coach Jenkins said that you guys focus a lot on the defense. The offense is just maintaining that efficiency, and that's also something that Mike Malone said during pregame was that the the deflections that you guys get in the game is just so tremendous. What was so special in particular about tonight that made it so good? Um, yeah, just sticking with the game plan, um, trying to, you know, not let them, you know, kind of get in the groove or settle in or be as comfortable um, as they can. They got, you know, a lot of talent, um, you know, on that roster and um, just trying to make everything difficult for them, not trying to let them um, get to spots easy or see, you know, one or two shots go down um, that are wide open and uncontested or anything like that because that's all they need uh, to catch fire. Uh, we just wanted to be active and, and make, you know, things as difficult as possible for them on that side of the floor. All right. Thanks, guys. Thank you, guys.